is your windows installation showing the error we could not find any drivers to get a storage driver click load driver don't worry you are not alone this error is very common especially with laptops and desktops with intel 10th generation or newer processors in this video i will walk you through two simple and effective method to fix this step by step this error usually happens because windows is missing the intel rapid storage technology rst driver which is needed to detect your storage device as you can see none of my drivers are showing up here and because of this missing driver you may also come errors like windows can't install on this disk or we couldn't find any drivers these issues all come from the same root cause and now let's fix them step by step so let's get started to fix it here's what we need to do first temporarily remove your bootable usb from the system and plug it into a working computer since i am just demonstrating i'll be showing you the process directly on this laptop now open your browser and in the search bar type intel rapid storage technology from the search results click the official intel website There you will find different versions of the driver. Some are specifically for 10th and 11th gen processors. And if you are using a 13th generation processor like I am, then simply go to the search bar and type Intel Rapid Storage Technology 13th generation to find the correct driver. Just make sure you know your CPU generation before downloading. Once you have identified the correct version, scroll down. Click download. accept the terms and click on download manually when the save as option appears you can save it anywhere you like i am saving it on my desktop to keep it simple and the file will begin downloading after the download finishes now right click on the setup file copy it and paste it into your c drive to keep things organized create a new folder i'll name it rapid but you can use any name you like and paste the setup file here now we need to extract the driver files for this we will use powershell plug your usb drive into the computer In the Windows search bar, type PowerShell. Right click and choose Run as Administrator. Now copy the path of your new Rapid folder. In PowerShell, type cd space c colon backslash rapid and then press Enter. Now we are inside the Rapid folder. Next, run this extraction command. Dot space backslash setup rst. Dot exe space hyphen. extract driver space g colon backslash rst now replace g with the letter of your usb drive then hit enter after running this a pop up will appear and the files will be extracted to your usb drive once it's complete you will see the rst folder on your usb Now plug this USB drive into the computer where you are installing Windows. During installation when you see the message we couldn't find any driver 
or Windows can't install on this disk, click Load Driver. Then click Browse. After that, select your USB. Then open the RSD folder. Now navigate to the VMD folder. There you will see your appropriate storage drivers for your device. Now click OK. The Intel driver will now appear. Select it and install it. And as you can see, it's searching for disks. Now as you can see that all the disks are showing up. From here, you can smoothly continue with the Windows installation as usual. Drive still not showing up? Don't worry, let's move to the next fix. On our desktop, go to the Windows search bar. Type System Information and open it. Now look for Baseboard Manufacturer and Baseboard Product. That's your motherboard's brand and model. On a laptop, just note down the full model number, usually written on a sticker or in your system settings. Now search Google for your motherboard or laptop model. Now go to the official manufacturer's website. Then open the support or driver section. Now you need to enter your model number here. And look under storage. Here you will find the Intel Rapid Storage Technology Driver. Sometimes it may also be called SETA, IRST or RAD. The name can vary slightly. Once you have found it, download the driver and save it wherever you want. Now extract it and copy the driver's folder to your USB. Now plug the USB into the system where you are installing Windows. On the error screen, click Load Driver, then click Browse. Now go to your USB drive. Now here you have to select the driver that you downloaded. Expand F6, then VMD. Now select F6 VMD FLPY x64 folder and click on OK. Now the Intel RST VMD driver will now appear. Select it and click on install. This will load the Intel RST driver and your storage drive should finally be detected. And that's it. With these two methods, you should be able to fix the we couldn't find any drivers error during Windows installation. I truly hope this guide made things easier for you. So that's it for today. If this tutorial helped, then please give it a like, share and subscribe our channel for more tech tutorial and fixes. Thank you. Thanks for watching.